Our story begins on a magnificent bridge. As a boy, chances upon a bright-eyed girl gazing out upon the water. It is love at first sight. His name is Romeo of the House of Montague. Hers, Juliet of the House of Capulet. Their families have been feuding for generations with no sign of their hatred waning. Phew, that was a bit long, wasn't it? Uh, but it was perfect. O oh, Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou Romeo? Deny thy father and refuse thy name. Or if thou willest it, I shall cast aside mine. I don't know, I'm not cut out for this stuff, really. Call me but love, Juliet. And what's in a name? That which we call a rose by any other name would smell as sweet. <clears throat> I... <clears throat> I love thee, Romeo. And I thee, forever even in the cold embrace of death. No, Romeo. Thou must livest with me until time itself expires. But the stars have other plans in mind. An unfortunate stabbing or two plunges their family's relations to a new low. A humble man of the cloth, Friar Lawrence, takes pity on the youths and comes to Juliet with an idea. Friar Lawrence, I am to be wed to a man I do not love. Is there no escape? No ploy to bring Romeo and I together as one? Take thou this vial and drink thou off. For two and forty hours, thou shalt go stiff and stark and cold like death. Find thou this courage, and after thou art born to the crypt, thou shalt rise again and be with Romeo. Give me, give me, oh, tell not me of fear. The letter that was to inform Romeo of their plan is lost en route by the messenger. After Juliet's servant, Balthazar, tells Romeo of her death, he sneaks into her family crypt, wracked with grief. O oh, my love, death hath had no power yet upon thy beauty. And yet never again shall I gaze into those deep pools that are thine eyes. Thus with a kiss I die, may we meet again in a world untouched by strife. Here's to my love. Romeo takes a deadly poison and breathes his last breath. Then, and only then, does Juliet wake. Romeo, it cannot be. Gone from me, and wherefore? Oh, churl. Shall I never hear my name dance from thy lips again? But now we can be together. Soon after, word of the young lover's death reached their quarreling families. Although the tragedy brought the feud to a close, Poor Romeo and Juliet 
would never know it. <laughs> 